my name is Bianca, and today I'm here at the American Red Cross Food and Nutrition Program. And I'm here to tell you that you should volunteer. Now I have three points to tell you. That's right, three. The first point is you're going to feel actually really good. And the second point is that you're going to get good ex like job experiments. And the last point is just an example. The first point is that the first point is the first point is that we um your heart feels as probably big as your head. It's just the most amazing feeling in the world. It feels like you're a hero to them. If you come back next time, some people actually remember you. So that is awesome. Like I can't even explain it, but if you want to feel that, you should totally go help out. And so second point, the second point is it gives you good job experiments. So right now I'm 10 and five years later, I'm 15. Now that means I've worked here five years. That's going to do I would get hired in like that. So that's another reason. I think the third point is we need to talk about something. Now, say there's this the American Red Cross, they just started, they just opened, and three adults are in there. Just the owner. The owner and two friends. And there's a humongous line there to the sign all the way to that light post. I'm, and I'm pretty sure they're probably going to only get three-fourths of it done. And that means they're just going to go starving. And that can happen. It's not just in... It's not just in other places. It's also in the U.S. And my friend was so shocked when she heard that, she couldn't believe it at all. And we had to tell her it's true, It's and it's sad, people starve. They, they, they don't have shelter, and they stay in the snow. And that must have been cruel in Boston. But let's just keep it short and simple. Now, this was, this is Bianca from Boston, um, about life facts. So I'm just begging you, please go volunteer. You're gonna feel amazing no matter what. 